What's up, y'all? Welcome back. We got baby girl next to us now. Nah, I like how they changed it up. Got some trouble here, I see. Let's investigate, shall we? Hello? Turn it off. What's in here? Oh, some goodies for your boy. Oh, shoot. Dead buddy. Cassette. I feel so dumb. I should have landed on that field. We were still flying and it looked like we could have gone on for some time. And then that damn power line. It's been 10 years, but I can still be alive. Anyways, we'll have to make ourselves at home here now since we're alive. The bridge seems like a nice place. At least it's not going to get flooded. We might end up going to Moscow by rail later. Well, we'll have to live and see about that. Mm. I feel so dumb. I should have landed on that field. Oh, me. Poor thing. Got crawdads on the surface. Ooh, we got a lot of crawdads on the surface. Are oh, they busting at some of them? I'm gonna try not to shoot as much as I can. They are popping. Okay, maybe we're gonna have to kill him. Come on, buddy. Oh. Fuck, I'm missing. Bro, this thing is freaking invincible. What the heck? All right, gotta be. Oh my god! Oh my god! He's still up. That's too many bullets. That's a lot of them bullets. Probably should have got that fucking sniper that was in there. Back at the place. Here's RTM back from the abyss of NATO. You're alive! <laughs> of course. Impressive after the horrors Duke told us about. Let's go. Dad's talking to Katya right now. They are so nice, both Katya and her daughter. And Katya's medical training will come in handy. Thank you for the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artyom, a moment. Thank you, Artyom. Artyom, stop by my desk you once you're done talking to the old man. So I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. That's pretty His far, don't you think? required if we are to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yaramak can't handle the repairs alone. So, once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. 
<laughs> now we know for Gatch sure boss. that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. <sighs> there might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably garrisoned the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge. Alright, I'll be back. Baby, you coming with me? Yes, Uncle Tom. Thank you. And your wife is great. She's kind and really strong. Oh, Thank I know. You, Auntie Anna. No problem. There you, you go, rest Artem. well. As I always said, you lucked out with me. I did. We all lucked out with Anna. She's a total dead eye. Now I only wish your mom could come with us too. With a real medic, we'd become unstoppable. <laughs> Katya, Nastya, come have some tea. Don't be shy. Thank you. Alright, baby, I'll be back. Got some business to handle. Oh, shit. I guess I find the weapons and stuff out there. Definitely gone. Oh, Should have picked up that sniper. Let me go pick it up. But I don't want to leave my pistol because pistols okay. <laughs> Do I got like a stash or something? I doubt it. I like your Spanglish. The compass attached to your notebook will always point towards the current objective. Gotcha. Just looked at that. These things, oh my god. They hard to kill. Freaking. Oh boy. You again. Oh shit. Oh boy. This fucking jamming ass gun. Oh. I think I could go in the water. We gotta take this slow, cause look at all these enemies. Oh my god, we only got five bullets, bro. Are you kidding? good no more health oh my god we should have did this stealthily or something we're dead we got our feet i guess Scrap. Oh yeah, I can make ammo. I think. Gotta get somewhere safe. This ain't safe. Let me see. Maybe on top of there. If I can. Don't forget to craft ammunition. Yeah, I know. I was just thinking about that. 
but stay out of the water. Ah, shit. Can we perhaps go in here? Ooh. Shotguns are effective at close range, especially against mutants. Definitely gonna need that. Look at this little spot. Okay. What's this? Armor. Electrical equipment. Oh, oh, okay, that's not bad, all right. Dang, what the? Oh, cleaning it. That's why this bad boy keep jamming. I still don't know how to do the ammo. Alright, now we're cooking. We got a shotgun. Ammo, though. There we go. Shot. Let's crap some. Fuck. I ain't got no ammo, but I think we'll be okay. Wait, it says point to my objective. Oh, it's a little house. Okay. I think we gotta go that way, like that. Oh, yeah. Let's be a little stealthy. Down there. Good. Oh shit, he's in there. I don't know how well they can see. Oh shit, he right there. Oh, they just hide now, okay. Slow. See how well they can see. Good, good. What the hell? What the hell? That scared me. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is that? This place is creepy crawling with shit. <gasps> oh my god. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Get off. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Turn it off now. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, that scared the heebie jeebies out of me. I need to loot everything. I don't really have a lot. Got some shells on them. X. Shit. Sorry, I know y'all can't see nothing. Just trying to clear this place out real quick. And I believe the they see the flashlight, so there ain't nothing. Anything? I know there's gonna be somebody in here. Let's just catch him before he catches us. It so far so good. Shit. This place is spooked. This place got me spooked. Jesus, I'm on edge. Big edges. Fuck, no, I ain't getting on a boat. You seen what's out there? I thought I heard all. Shoot. What's that guy? <gasps> Don't do that. Does he see me or not? He see me. Oh. The heck? Oh my goodness. Uh. Anonymous fast rate. Dang. Oh. Well, I got a guess. Put gas on. Maybe. Put a gas mask. Maybe that'll help. Silos. Let me just throw on the gas mess. Got three minutes. Think that is three minutes, right? Oh, there's another one. There's two. I can take them. Make sure I'm reloaded. Uh. Can. I 
I don't know if you could sneak up on these guys. I'm actually, I think I'm about to try. I'm about to try to sneak up on them. Oh, you just knock him out. <laughs> well, I would rather kill him. Alright, we got it out right there. Oh my god. Oh my god. This place is crawling. Maybe... Get him to come over here, and when he walking back, jump on him. I don't think he can see me in the dark. One minute, gotcha. Oh, that's 50 seconds, all right. Uh, what was it, F? Oh. <laughs> Bitch, put one in there. Bitch, oh shit, he didn't die. Ah. Oh, fuck. Yeah, we can't be shooting this bitch out like that. Shit. Got it. Can we take our gas mask off down here? Oh, he don't like this. My bad, my bad. Over here. Oh, that's him. Shut up, boy. Oh, well. All right. Did hey, you see me? Um, oh, you definitely seen me. Let's not wake up the fish. They got their one. That's it, right? Nope. I swear I look like you get up there. I do that bad boy. Sorry, we got three. Oh, if I would have came up right here. That would be bad.
Hey, we got a mall and nice and neat pal though. That wasn't too bad. I was just trying to do a perfect. Oh shit, oh shit. Shit. Do they know I'm here? They couldn't possibly know I'm here yet. But I do. Cover me, cover me. What? How am I getting over there towards you? Oh, good shit. Holy shit! Handle that, yeah. Not that bad. Coming. Oh, that's pretty Come neat. You pretty amazing, Bratuha. That was crazy. Blit. Those mutants are pretty hardcore. The villagers I never have a chance against them. You? You just cut through them, Blit. Well, it's, it's what I do, man. You. Name's Christ, by the way. Are you from the train? Bet the locals wouldn't even talk to you guys. <laughs> Open fire right away, didn't they? <laughs> of course, those dumb bastards. I've been here long enough to know the drill. They have a cult over there. The dumbasses are hung up on technology having destroyed the old world. So they don't exactly take kindly to smart guys here. And me? Huh? They were just gonna lock me up until I agreed to go fight those electrical demons of theirs to absolve my sins. Because I was in cahoots with Satan, apparently, blyad. <laughs> Some Satanist I am. <laughs> I've been fixing engines and trading all my life. Now, now I'm moving to the east. Blin, I'm sick of this part of country. There's just nothing to do here anymore. The cities are gone. Bandits, beasts all around. Lots of space across the Volga, though. Plenty of opportunity. So, I came here with my rail car full of trading goods, hoping to make a few sales on the way east. What a fool I was. I was lucky to get out alive. <laughs> anyway, since you've arrived, I've been thinking of this little plan I had, never had a chance to pull off alone, but since you guys are also going east... Now, judging by what I could see with my binoculars, it's a miracle your engine is still running. Oh, by the way, take the binoculars. I'll show you where everything is. Look at the bridge first. See that section on top? It should lower if the emergency mechanism still works. Katya from the church should know better. I've never been to the bridge myself. There, to the right, that huge hangar. That's a terminal blip. The cult is considered a holy place. Covered it all in graffiti, schmafiti. Their tarfish live there, you know? Stupid bastards. Even further right, see the building near all those carriages? Used to be a train depot. There are some bandits there now, but the place itself ain't bad. Oh, the area nearby isn't too bad either. There's a good hunting and stuff. I set up several safe camps around there. If you find them, you could rest, fix your equipment. <laughs> Unless you prefer spending nights at an open campfire. Now, come on, let me show you my home now. Let's go see your career, man. Here 
here is my cave. And this is where I live. Not a palace, but oh, here's a bed. So if you're tired, my home is your home. I made a workbench to tinker on. If you need ammo or grenades, there's some uh, raw materials here. So help yourself. You can have anything Thanks, you like. Thanks, man. Can't carry all the shit anyway. Come on, don't be shy. I appreciate this, bro. Oh, anyhow, gotta tell you, this isn't just a pretty face. I've got a whole lot of knowledge stored up in here. And look at these hands. They know how to fix stuff. You'll never have second thoughts about picking me up. Nice some more. Well, I definitely need more health. I have to buy some smokes from the villagers before the assholes chase me away. Bro. Dumb cretins didn't like my life. Huh? I've been banned from the village and the bridge ever since. I think that would be fine. But I guess you shouldn't start a fight with them right away. They are dumb and brainwashed, so they were probably just scared shitless by your arrival. How bad they thought Judgment Day had come and right on time, too. <laughs> No, you could take the zipline down. Just hook up and uh, where you go. Nice. Appreciate you. Nothing to fear from them. Yeah. The bees. Well, that's another story, though. All right, bro. Thanks, man. Take these ugly mutant bastards from earlier, for example. One of them. It's nothing. But you come across a pack of them, or just run. I once had to drop all my shit to just get away, and I consider myself lucky. Will do. Have you seen them fucking crawdads out there? Ooh, the motherfuckers are smart. Throwing rocks. Those things hurt like hell. Humans are always worse. Some bandits came here recently. I have no idea what they want. They didn't approach the bridge or the village even once. They just sit there, bullets, waiting for something. But. I know they are bad news, you know? Villagers say people started going missing when the bandits come. You, know, you go fishing or something, then you just don't come back. Well, I could go on for ages like this, but your leader wanted something done. Just go on ahead, I'll gather some stuff here. I'll see you at your train! Alright, bye, thanks.